So this is what raw amber looks like. This is what raw amber looks like, and then this is what polished amber looks like. This is a piece that's half raw, half polished. This is called a slab. And this is Dominican amber, fossilized tree resin from the Dominican Republic. It's 20 million years old, so it's a fossil of the resin exuded from a tree. And these are some uh, slabs from of amber right here. So like this one, for example, and some little smaller one, very nice and clear. Bigger one, not as clear, but a nice big chunk of amber. And use my flashlight to illuminate it. You can see that is a big chunk of fossilized tree resin, amber. And so if you guys want this stuff, the first person to say take, takes it. This is raw amber from the Dominican Republic. It's a higher quality piece because it's very yellow, translucent, and gemmy, and no big cracks in it. This piece here, oh no, this piece, oh, that is like a candy yellow piece. That's a super good one. If somebody wants a very triple A piece, that is beautiful, raw Dominican amber. Very clear and yellow. It would also make a good tabletop piece too, because you don't have to polish it. It's just, especially when you backlight it and you see how clear it is, that's very clear versus like this one's much less clear. And so, uh, generally speaking, the more clear, the better, but sometimes it can have inclusions inside, which are also very good. So that piece definitely gets my recommendation. You see how this piece is not as translucent? This one's still pretty good, but it's not as translucent as the last one. It's also thicker. This one, Mr. Primitivo, welcome to the show. And take, was that a take on the last one? Because I know you like the high quality pieces, right? So I think you wanted this one, which was 38. This one I like a lot. That's a really good clear gemmy color. Do you plan on polishing this one? Hello, Bo Ali, welcome to the show. And Mr. Primitivo, I'm writing you down right now. This one, decent piece, pretty clear. Pretty clear, thick skin on it. More raw high end, clear end, no inclusions. Okay. I'd say this is like B plus, not quite high end. This one's pretty good. We'll call, I'm gonna start a new section, okay? So we're gonna call this number one. And this is, this is I Am Frogger take on this one, right? For 29, this one for 29, Frogger. And welcome to the show, how's your day going? I'm writing it down right now. This one's better, this one's pretty good, but it's got a little bit of inclusions, but pretty big and gemmy. Like in general, like if you were shopping anywhere else, this would, all of these would be really crazy good. More raw, high end, clear, no inclusions. Okay, so high end, clear, no inclusions. Let's see what else we can find. Not clear enough. That one's mine. Mmm, kind of higher end. Pretty clear. Not the not my favorite shape. Pretty clear, but not crazy. I'm gonna keep it number three. This little one, I'm liking this one. Uh, it's actually pretty small, but very high end. It's not the best for polishing, so I don't know if you want one for polishing or if you just want it to keep it raw. If you want to keep it raw, that's a good one because it doesn't have too many flat surfaces to polish, but uh, it has that one little cut side right there. You can see a little bit of greens coming out of it. So that's going to be piece number four at 21. Oh, here we go. This is probably the best we're going to find in the lot. So this one's at 40 even. I can't believe I've had this one this whole time. 40 even. That's a good color. Really clear. $40 takes this one. Uh, Gen CT, I think you were asking for a higher end one. I think I am Frogger says take, and then Cora says me, and then Jen says take. So this one's going to I am Frogger. I am Frogger gets this one. Got to be the first to say take. Because uh, cause I know you're asking for it, but asking does not give you dibs on the show. I'm sorry if that wasn't clear before, but I hope that you guys understand. I just It's always the first person to say take. All right, thanks, Jen, for understanding. Frogger, this one's going to you. Very good. And we're going to keep looking. Maybe we'll find another one. Okay, what is this guy? Very low quality. Very low quality. Interesting. Like, it looks cool here, but that is not the droid we are looking for. Um, charming little reddish yellowish piece, medium quality, B grade, but cool little piece. Oh, here's a big and gemmy one with some really cool lines. This one's at 90. This one's a big one. Cool stratification, very clear. 
So there is like the stratification means layers here and they're very beautiful and it would be a really good layer to polish. No major cracks in it. There is something big inside, but you can't really tell what it is. You, it's probably just layers, but there could be some inclusions inside. That's a pretty good piece, especially if you're looking for a big one. Uh, Pablo, I do polish, but not like, I don't offer that as a service. Small piece, pretty gemmy, but small. Some like dust and stuff running through it. Looks like some interesting inclusions. What about this guy? Nah. This one's like... Hints of blue. Hints of blue in this one. And there's more to be polished. This one's kind of like a big mystery one right here, but there's some pretty clear sections. If anybody wants to take a mystery piece, maybe find colors or insects. This one will be at 29. Oh, here's a pretty, here's a pretty yellow one. No cracks. Interesting shape. Cora, nice take. A very cool shape on this one. And a lot of like natural, very soft edges on it. And I'm seeing like what wants to be little hints of blue, but you never know until you polish it. So Cora, good take. Card. Oh, here's a gemmy one. This one's really nice. Uh, $26 for this one. $26 for this one. Some cool greens. Very, this is gonna be really cool flow lines on this one. I can already tell. Can, can you guys see how it's got like the curved layers like that? There's gonna be very good ones on this one. That one's no inclusions, but pretty pretty nice and clear, but there's gonna be some cool flow lines. That one, 